I have to ask you about Khabib. So I remember a while ago, Rogan said that uh, that's the perfect fight uh, yeah. for Khabib. You are. So let me ask two questions. The first, do you think you can beat him in an MMA match when you're at your peak? Yeah. I, I don't like, uh, yeah, I mean, it's one of those people where people like will get really mad at me if I say yes, but yeah, I mean. But I think, how would you do it? How would you solve that puzzle? Yeah. Uh, I mean, we would grapple, and I think I would be better than him. But, I, you know, I, 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 I feel weird saying because people, well, like, yeah, right, you're full of shit, you know. And, but that's, no no one out grappled him, right? I mean, nobody did. And maybe I'm wrong in this, but I, <laughs> if we look at the best possible candidates, I'm definitely one of them. And then obviously I'd have a small size advantage too. So in a wrestling match, so we can just reduce that MMA match to a wrestling match. Mm -hmm. What do you think is the right strategy on him? Like, do, do you understand his style, that the, the, the his wrestling style, the pressure he applies? Do you understand yeah. how the hell he makes it happen? Yeah, I mean, he never, unfortunately fought any real who i would say really really high level wrestlers i was actually really disappointed how bad justin gaethje's wrestling was because justin gaethje had some solid success but his wrestling was really bad in that fight um gaethje had success in uh, and NCAA. Okay. yeah i think he was seventh place okay. maybe or so somewhere he was definitely all american uh it was lower though um so yeah, I would I would like to see how he dealt with someone who was like a who I think oh man this guy's a really high level wrestler because you know we saw and this is early in his career but you know Glayson Tebow did give him some issues earlier in his career, um, so I would like to see him in that situation and see how he does. I would love to like you know like I tell you, I just love wrestling and grappling like yeah I'd love it. if someone said hey uh, Ben, you know Khabib wants to roll with you like, okay I'm there tomorrow it sounds like a blast let's go. He's probably competitive as hell. Yeah, you're still competitive. I know when to be and when not to be. Like, right. you know, say if I'm going to the high school kids or I'm not going to be competitive because then I'm just being a dick. How would you, know? you take him down? What? What, what, what we're talking about? Real wrestling? Like wrestling, wrestling? Wrestling, uh, wrestling. wrestling. I would probably try to take single legs and stuff. Single legs? Yeah. I haven't? Okay. No, no. I mean, I have no, I have, honestly, I, have, I don't have the slightest clue. I'd have to feel, I'd feel him out. Um, but single legs, my best take. Well, people talk part. about his wrestling being really good. Like yeah. people that train with him. Probably. So, okay. So I, I grilled someone, I will not say who on the Ed Ruth thing, because Ed Ruth yeah. is very elite at folk style wrestling. He never became that great at fighting, unfortunately. Wait, Ed Ruth wrestled Khabib? They were on the same team for a while. Yeah. Okay. And there was rumors that Khabib beat him up and i said i i sure can't believe that uh, and i've heard that that was if they were just straight wrestling ed would get slightly the better of it well ed but ruth is like one of the greats he's great he's really good yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that was what i heard that it, but in an mma setting because of all the tools that khabib would get him i don't know uh, it, well, but I agree. I agree with Rogan on this one. That would have been good to see. Yeah, that would be fun. So yeah, if Khabib wants to work out, I'd, I'd love it. I love I love wrestling and grappling. I don't do much jiu-jitsu because I just don't have time for it anymore. I'm at the wrestling academy like every single day. Uh, but uh, yeah, I, I love jiu-jitsu while I did it. And you know, if I didn't have wrestling academies, I probably would still be doing jiu-jitsu. Yeah, you did well in yeah. jiu-jitsu as well. But 